Or if you're driving out on the Austin roads, one thing you're likely paying attention to so you don't have to hit them are those potholes. KB's Tori Larnett joins us this morning to take a look at what the city is doing to keep our cars and us safe. Potholes are either reported by citizens who call 311 or by the city's public work employees who see them while they're out on the job and report them. Now, this year, the department hasn't seen as many of these complaints, in part because of the pandemic and not as many people hitting the Austin roads. In the 2020 fiscal year, Public Works received 1,300 pothole complaints. That's about 370 less complaints compared to 2019. Almost 600 of those complaints, though, were critical, meaning they were hazardous and the city needed to fix them within 24 hours. And while you may see some potholes while you're driving around, Public Works Manager Fernando Ortegon Jr. says they have responded to all the complaints that they've received. So if a driver does have an issue, the department just needs to get a heads up. The more reports we get from citizens that use the 311 system, the better off it is. You know, we'll be able to get out there, have eyes on it, um, and get it repaired in a timely manner. Potholes form when water on the street gets under the subgrade or the supportive base below the asphalt. Now, on top of less cars on Austin roads this year, Oregon believes they had less issues because the city is improving the infrastructure of its streets and the department is putting more into preventative maintenance. Oregon says they have plenty of money to fix the potholes around the city. In fact, it makes up less than half a percent of their department's budget. Of course, though, they do need your help in spotting them. So if you do have an issue with a pothole, the best thing you can do is call 311. Back to you.